Good girl, stay. Good stay. Hi, here at Doberman Details, many people ask us how to introduce your dog to a crate. So our suggestion is have the crate be large enough for the dog that it can turn around and lay down and cover it with a sheet or a blanket just on the sides and the back, leave the front open so it's more like a den or a little cave. You want it to be a safe place for them. They don't feel they're being punished. We never like to use it as a place for punishment, just a place to keep the dog safe. And if you have workmen in the house and you need to put the dog away for safety reasons, and we also suggest that you use indestructible toys, have it full with things that you can put peanut butter or cheese in. Kong makes a lot of treat toys and you can use raw hides. I like to use elk antlers. Uh, my dogs really like to chew on these. Um, Nyla bones, just anything. You don't want anything with stuffing that they can shred and ingest the stuffing. So put your dog on a leash, have a lot of real small treats and use a word. I use go crate. You can say kennel up, go kennel, house. People have different words, but whatever word you use, stick with it and be consistent and use the same word each time. Celine, are you ready? Okay, let's go. Go crate. Good crate. And a release word, okay, okay. She wants all the toys in here. Good girl. Go crate. So they feel comfortable going in and out. She's been in a crate before, but she's a good example anyway. Good girl, okay. Go crate. Good job. And then after you've done this a number of times, close the door. Good crate and let them know that you're pleased. Good crate, give them lots of treats. Good crate, open the door. Okay, good girl, <laughs> good girl. And then after you've done this a number of times, uh, more than this, but it's a slow process, put them in the crate after you've practiced shutting them in the door, shut the door and um, release them. Selena, ready? Go crate. Good girl. Now I'm gonna take the leash off of her. I'm gonna close the door. And I'm gonna leave the room. Just for a few minutes. And you just put them in there just for a few minutes. Go back. Treat. Good girl. Good, crate, and then release them, and then do it again a little bit, and then release them, and um, do it throughout the day. Whenever you think of it, have them go in, close them in, and leave the room. Now, if they're barking or crying, you don't want to release them until they calm down. You don't ever want to let a dog out that's pawing at the door or crying. You want to let them out when they're calm, just like this, and busy with a toy. Open the door. Okay, good girl. So it's never meant for punishment, and um, you wait until they're relaxed to let them out. So I hope this is helpful, and um, these are the beginning stages of crate training. Thanks for watching.